Hey, what's up, guys? It's your boy, John from John's Reptile Page. Guys, this is just a little update on my 40 gallon. Guys, I added this statue right here. It was from my Crested Gecko tank, but like it was fitted like too tight inside the Crested Gecko tank. So I gave it to my bearded dragons. But I am gonna put more plants inside the Crested Gecko's terrarium to make it more full. It just looked like, you know, it looked a little too crowded. But, you know, I transferred it over to the 40 gallon and my bearded dragons are loving it. Look at that. This is my boy Capone. Getting nice stretched out. They are really enjoying this tank. You know, this is the heat side. I changed the bowl too. I got a hundred watts with I think was 75% more intense. So the tank really gets a lot warmer. You can see the gauges right there, 100, 100 in the middle, and even 100 on the cool side, which is pretty cool. They loving it. And that's my girl Red up there. She looks gorgeous. Um, I'm about to get them some pinky mice, some crickets, so I can feed them. But this is what the tank is looking like, guys. This right here, I'm going to get rid of. I mean, it looks like sand and stuff, but it's just a, like a little carpet thing that I bought from um, the pet store. But I, what I really want to do is put ceramic tiles here. So I'm going to put like one, two, three, and then get two extra ones and, and cut them in half in the back. Because I feel like the ceramic tile is going to be a lot easier to clean the tank. You know, wipe everything down, you know. With this little carpet, like, you know, you got to take the carpet out, dust it, or even sometimes wash it. Look, look at them. Components looking beautiful. And you know what I like about the tank, the back, the black background? I might do the same here or the same there and that side. But, yeah, look at my girl Red enjoying being up high. Looking beautiful. Capone right here. Also, like I said before, I got the double lights, you know, give it more light. And um, eventually, like I said before, I'm gonna put Capone or Red in their own 40 gallon soon because one is female, one is male. I don't want them, you know, to start mating. But um, yeah, man, look at the beauty, look at that. Capone. Yeah, guys, let me know what you guys think about the setup so far. I also want to put um another um either some jungle vine yes. or like, you know, a hammock. I'm leaning towards more like I'm leaning towards more getting them a hammock than a jungle vine. Because jungle vines are pretty like slim. I need something that they can really grab onto and walk on. Yeah, so you know why? Yeah, I'm definitely gonna get them a jungle vine. Beautiful. Yeah, guys, you know, so let me know what you guys think and what else you guys think I should put in the tank. Let me know. Or you guys think I should put like sand on one side and then do the ceramic on the, on the other side. Let me know. Yeah, he's so happy. Look at him just walking around. You know? Also about to give them a nice warm bath. And, you know, let them cool off. You know, rehydrate their bodies. Because, you know, being under these, under these lights, you know, they could get pretty warm. Look at that. They're beautiful. All right, guys. If you love this video, please like, share, subscribe, and hit that notification bell, guys. If you love bearded dragons, guys, we out of here later. Say bye, Capone. Later.